Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel. It's Yana here again. Do you know that recently I have received a Nutri Blizzard from a girlfriend for my belated birthday gift? What is Nutri Blizzard if you were to ask? Nutri Blizzard is actually uh, the blender for smoothie. Since I received that Nutri Blizzard, I've been doing my own smoothie bowl practically every single day. And at times, it's twice a day. I have been very obsessed with making smoothie bowl because I'm able to decorate it. And currently, I'm so obsessed with uh, smoothie bowl decoration. And these are some of the smoothie bowl that I have created. I love creating them. But as I am never a very creative or artsy person, I tend to be lost uh, on certain days on how to decorate my smoothie bowl. At the moment, my smoothie bowl is not yet perfect. I've been trying to perfect its texture, its iciness. So I hope to do a beautiful, perfect smoothie bowl someday. I would say this is a more or less uh, cooking video because I'll be including uh, footages of me making my smoothie bowl and also salad. I know salad is very easy to make, but I would like to share with all of you on how I personally make my own salad. Guys, Actually, uh, for today's video, right, I plan to put on my apron because I've actually made, made this apron for my cooking video. This apron says, eat up, go keto, and Yana ketogenic kitchen. However, when I put on this apron, it just don't fit nicely on me. I think it has got to do with this string. Probably, I need to modify this string somehow because it tends to uh, be too droopy that the wording will be out of frame which it doesn't make sense for this words to be out of frame because it's supposed to appear on the video so when i actually bring it up a bit right uh, it just gets so ugly it tends to wrinkle around here uh, just don't come out right i'll just explore on uh, ways to modify this uh, apron so that it will fit me well I think for those who have ever put up a cooking video will agree with me that it's kind of hard to uh, put a cooking video together when you film everything by yourself. So if there's any shortcoming in this video, I hope you'll forgive me and do put down your comments and suggestions on how am I supposed to uh, improve on my cooking video. I really need all the suggestions. It's alright if your suggestion is negative but most important is constructive. Uh, you can comment uh, on the shortcoming of this video but at the same time also do give your suggestion uh, on how am I supposed to improve this video for now let's enjoy this video that I have put together hi everyone okay today we will be making salad without any meat because I don't have any meat with me at the moment my husband is out to get me uh, some chicken uh, so for now while waiting for my husband to be back to bring the chicken for my meal later so for now we will just prepare a very simple salad okay we are going to use ingredient that's available at home making salad is not difficult you can use whatever things that you have at home to enhance the flavor and to add on uh, to the whole salad setup okay at home now i have this classic mixed salad Okay, you don't have to buy uh, those salad in this packet. You can buy those uh, butter heads or oak leaf uh, that's in the uh, separate packaging and mix all them together. But you know, uh, sometimes uh, when you are a working person, you just want to make things fast. You just want to prepare meal fast without having to chop a lot of things. So now here I have a classic mixed salad and this is apple mint. Apple mint is very delicious if you were to add it in your smoothie or your salad. Yes, it's very tasty because it's very fragrant. Wow, I love the smell of apple mint or other mint. Okay, here we have the sunflower seeds. I actually also have pumpkin seed but it's not yet open so I do not want to open it at the moment because I still have lots of uh, pumpkin seed. We will not use any uh, luxurious dressing. Okay, uh, so for today we will be making salad using lemon juice as a dressing. Uh, it's more healthy this way and also it is refreshing. Okay, I'll take one piece of cheese here to add on to the salad and here. I have a few almonds 
and some small remaining cashew nuts so we will just put everything that we have here inside the salad bowl firstly of course we put in the salad you can use as much salad as you desire all the colors, all the different uh, shapes of salad make it, making it look so delicious so don't put as much as you want so I'll put more okay okay I'll put this much of salad okay I've washed the apple mint leaf so we are just going to add this inside and yeah and put it everywhere here okay the apple mint leaf okay now we can start um, sprinkling the nuts oh oops we start with the uh, sunflower nuts sunflower nuts a lot a lot a lot a lot some of the elements and I've got some bits of cashew nuts here <laughs> we'll just add them in okay okay and now we shall put in the cheese you can just break the cheese and put it all over okay you can use any type of cheese uh, at the moment I, I only have this sliced cheese so we shall make do with this sliced cheese okay so you can just add on your favorite cheese can be inside and here we go okay so make it more pretty to so put it here okay okay the last part is of course the dressings and today we'll be using the lemon juice okay you can put as much or as little as you want Ta -da! now our salad is ready it's simple right so to live a healthier lifestyle is actually easy you just to make things convenient for you and you work your way initially I feel that making salad is very um, inconvenient it's such a hassle because I need to chop all those leaves the greens just make it the best way you can and if you are the lazy type like me just grab the mixed salad from the packet and yes it will work that way okay and now let's move on to our smoothie making session as I am on ketogenic diet uh, we will minimize the usage of fruits so we will not put any of these frozen fruits inside the blender but instead we are going to use the fruits for decoration for liquid we will be using a half cup of almond milk normally if i were to uh, blend a smoothie to make it into a smoothie drink i will normally put in the flaxseed meal the sunflower seed and also the chia seed inside the blender to be mixed together with the whole smoothie but as we are doing the smoothie bowl yes we are going to save all this and make it into a props that's to decorate the smoothie bowl for the frozen vegetable i'm using the cucumbers and also the lime if you like to use less ice it's best actually you I put in more uh, frozen items for the non frozen vegetables I'm using celery avocado and also green oak leaf as the opening of the jar is at the bottom we will start by putting in the frozen fruits cucumber lemon celery avocado the green oak leaf and a half cup of almond milk and now to start blending Pour the smoothies inside this bowl. Okay. 
and let's decorate the bowl. This is the flex seat. Look like crumb, right? Okay, all delicious. This is the chair seat. Okay. Let's surround the bowl with the sunflower seed. It's okay if the sunflower drop because we shall use this as decoration later on. Okay, let's surround it. Fill it up with sunflower seeds. Yay! And now let's use the blueberry to continue to decorate the bowl. I'm truly obsessed with this um, smoothie bowl. Not only is it healthy, but it enhances your creativity. Though I make this smoothie bowl every day, I don't find that it's a chore because I really enjoy doing it. I enjoy making the smoothie bowl and I enjoy eating the smoothie bowl. I hope you enjoy looking at this smoothie bowl. It's definitely not easy to film a cooking video or food preparation video all by yourself. But definitely, this will not deter me from doing more such video in future. This is all for today, everyone. Take care of yourself. Have a great day. And please stay safe and be happy always. Love all of you. Have a good day. Thank you everyone for watching and if you appreciate this video, please give this video a thumbs up and do leave your comments as I would love to hear from all of you. Feel free to subscribe to my channel if you haven't. I love all of you. Have a good day.